We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome to the Freak Show, where our one rule is, if at first you don't succeed, hope that no one saw. I am your host today, Bumpy McSquiggums, and we are embarking on our very first adventure in the Armored Core series, Armored Core 6, Fires of Rubicon. It is the latest from, from Software and Bandai Namco, releasing on August 24th, 25th, uh, 2023. Uh, this is the PC version of the game. Like I said, very first time in an Armored Core series, in an Armored Core game, I have no idea how good or bad I'm going to be. Probably terrible, but I'm looking forward to this. Uh, big shout out and a thank you to Crazy Comrade for turning me on to the series as a whole. Uh, he just got done playing through like a month ago every single game in the Armored Core series. You guys can go check that on his YouTube account. Uh, I will have a link down below for you guys to go check it out. And starting on the 25th at midnight, the 25th, so at the very beginning, so in like a few hours from now, depending on when I get this video up, uh, he's going to be going live on Twitch as soon as the console release around midnight Eastern on crazy that's c-r-a-z-z-y comrade c-o-m r-a-d-e sorry brain brain's not working there all one word crazy comrade with two z's basically um on twitch he's gonna be doing a, a 24 hour stream or in, at least until he beats it if he beats it within the 24 hours that's his goal that's his plan that's what he's trying to do so he's a massive armored core fan uh, he's, again, he's played all of the games, most of them several times. He loves the series, and he's been super hyped and amped up and excited for this. Uh, it's rubbed off on me, and uh, despite me trying to work with him, trying to do some collaborative stuff, we got to do one thing together. That was cool, but uh, he's a busy man. I guess I'm a busy man. We can't seem to see eye to eye, but still one of the only content creators that I watch regularly. Uh, highly recommend you check it out. Anyway, enough shilling for everyone. I mean, I'm not really shilling. I'm just sharing my thoughts and you know opinions and things that i like uh, i'm ready to get started guys again so let's begin our very first endeavor into armored core just the brightness no thank you this is the pc version if i didn't mention that so we'll see how this goes that's fine probably i don't care pilot name well i think we all know what my name is it's bumpy mcsquiggums Close to Rubicon. Wake the dog up. Is that me? Am I the dog? Handler Walter verified. Activating cerebral coral control device. Augmented human C4621 has awakened. Time to get to work, 621. Is that me? My 621? I'm powering down your entry capsule. On my signal. Now, activate the AC. Yes, please. It looks very hot. I definitely want some air conditioning. Oh, it's the Death Star. Things aren't going the way we planned them to go. Uh huh. Did I just get turned into a puddle of jelly? What happened? What is going on? I mean. Descent to ISB 2262, Rubicon 3, complete. There's no way we survived that. Your position is grid 135. Off target, but within permissible range. There's a catapult ahead. Use it to close the gap. How would I have conceivably survived that? I would have been turned into a pancake at the bottom of the... the... Main system. 
the armored gourd, I guess. Or macro mobile suit, whatever you want to call it. Okay, move around with the... Oh, uh, no, okay, it's not going to give me control controls. Alright, whatever, that's fine. Um, I am using a PlayStation 5 controller. It's giving me, for some reason, PC controls. That's fine. I can jump. I can look around with the camera, which I think I may increase the sensitivity of. I don't know for sure. All right. Uh, boost moving on. Nope, that wasn't it. Uh, looks like holding square or pressing square turn boost moving on. Okay. Oh, we can go for a while. Oh. Oh, and I, and I fell short. Alright, that seems fine. Some actions consume EN uh, and are disabled when energy... Yep, got it. Uh-huh, how do I... Uh, close, okay. The reticle automatically targets on-screen enemies. Oh, okay. When there are multiple enemies, the enemy closest to the center of the screen will be prioritized. Move the camera to change priority. Okay, that makes sense. Clear out those guard mechs. I, Perfect chance I, to test your AC. Uh, Alright, we're going to try RB, I guess. Surprise! So it's, uh... It was my right arm, I guess. What this? So R3 does something. Um, I kind of... Alright, guys, hold on. Okay, there we go. Alright, I have it set now correctly for what it's supposed to be. Uh, target assist keeps your AC oriented toward the target. When enabled, your AC will automatically lock its orientation toward enemies as you approach them. You can still use the camera to change targets. Uh, sure. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it's really fluid movement. It's a little bit weird to get used to. Uh, the missile launcher equipped to the right shoulder of this AC is capable of multi-lock, which allows you to attack multiple enemies simultaneously while holding down the input for that weapon. Okay. Let it go. Sure. So far, I like it. It feels okay to play, uh, control-wise. That was my uh, biggest concern. Just about everything else, I feel is fine. Like, I, I understand how Armor Core is played. I understand you know, various different things. Uh, the control scheme is the thing that I was uh, the most concerned that I'd have a hard time adapting to. But I still think I'm going to struggle with it. But it feels pretty good. I'm not going to lie. It feels pretty good right now. Use repair kits to repair your AC and recover armor points. Repair kits can be used up to three times per mission, but cannot be used in rapid succession. Okay, I might. Did I get hit? I don't think I got hit. Damage. No, it hasn't. Patch it up. I mean, I'll I'll do Two it. Repair kits remaining. I I didn't take damage though. See All the right. contaminated city down there. That's where you're landing. Is it? Oh. Access the catapult. That's cool. What does circle do? Okay, I have a I have a blade, which has got a, apparently a long cooldown. All right, uh, let's access it. This is this is pretty cool. Do I want to jump on this or something? I suppose we're figuring it out as we go. Huh? All right. I feel a bit scraggly, to be honest. But I'm here for it. Time to fly, six two one. 
Alright, this is pretty sweet. If we get our hands on Rubicon's coral, we'll make a killing. Plenty for a merc with a fried brain like you to buy their life back. Thanks. Look, I didn't know the Dorito powder would have that effect, okay? I'm sorry. Enough chat, back to work. Uh, Scavenge these you said anything to him? Find a valid mercenary license. Oh. We're illegals here. You'll need ID to operate. Okay. Oh, I see some, some baddies up front. So I assume that you don't do a lot of uh, quick boost. Uh, lets you instantly accelerate in any direction, helping you evade attacks, swiftly closing on enemies. Yeah, yeah. All right, whatever. Let's trigger it. Surprise! Affiliation unknown. Shut it down. Guerrillas from the Liberation Front. If we get in the way of our work, eliminate them. Oh, wait for it. Uh. Oh, that felt good. That felt good. All right, this this feels really slick. I like this a lot. I feel like we do we do we take damage? No, our our AP is in the bottom left. I, okay, I see it there now. I thought it was somehow in the middle, but it's not. Uh, I guess we haven't found the thing yet. Use assault boost to move rapidly in the direction that the camera is facing, or... Oh. Okay. I'm picking up signals from AC Rex. Follow the markers. Uh... Okay. Woo! I'm gonna run out of uh, juice here in a second. Uh-oh. Uh oh, what's up, boys? Oh, think they saw me? I feel like they might have saw me. Ah, I'm sure it's fine. Find out who they're working for. Am I out of bullets? Like got shields. Good thing you've got a blade. Hey. I think I'm just not used to the uh, the time it takes to reload. I think that's probably... Yeah, they're following me. Alright, let's uh, let's deal with our, our hanger-oners. Yeah. Is that it? Is that all you guys got? Come on now. Sounds like a party to me. License code extracted from an AC wrecked in the contaminated city contains the pilot registration data. Registration number RB18 call sign Thomas Kirk. Rank 26 slash E. Affiliation independent. License expired. Well, that's not good. This one's already expired. I, I noticed. Keep looking. Yeah, all right. All right. Oh, you can really climb pretty high in this. What? Uh -oh. 
Oh, oh, what is that? Yeah, I, I would never do anything to upset them. <laughs> um, yeah, nobody saw anything. Just gonna casually sneak around down here. Sure, will be fine. Analyzing. All right. Uh, lo license code extracted from an AC wreck in the contaminated city. Uh, pilot. Okay. Uh, registration number RB29. Uh, call sign is G7 Hakra. Uh, rank 22D. Uh, Balam Industries, and it expires in 12 hours. Eh. Corp license easily traced. Forget it. So going for our final uh, license. All right. Oh, hello. Well, that all seemed fine. Oh, what? Except for this guy who randomly showed up. How dare you, sir? You know who I am. I'm not even sure, so I, I imagine you probably don't. Alright. Let's, uh, well. We guns to hustle. Stop Yeah. Surprise! Come on. I'd like to say that was easy, but yeah, it was it was it was relatively easy. About this license. Oh, give me, give me. All right, and registration RB thirty seven Monkey Gordo. No clat, no rank. Okay, uh, independent, and I got fifteen days. I guess this is it. We're monkey. It's still valid, but the pilot's rank is no good. We can't use this. Oh, okay. Never mind. I've picked up one more wreck six two. I bet you did. Transmitting marker. Go and check it out. There's people up there. Check them. Let's do a little hard landing. know why my thing didn't uh, actually activate there my missiles they should have while standing on a vertical catapult perform a jump to quickly reach high up places huh neat you can use that vertical catapult to get some altitude right hand ammunition at 50 percent is this the catapult oh, this is a helipad Oh, must be that thing. All right. Chee it didn't work at all. Do I have to stop moving to make it work? Yes, I do. That's it. Try accessing the rack. Seems fine. Sure nothing bad will happen here. Registration number RB23. Rank fits the bill. Call sign. What? Uh oh. Looks like they were on to you after 
Oh. I'm in no mood to pick a fight with the PCA. Ah. It doesn't matter. Take it out now. They won't have enough to ID you. Really? This is uh, not going well for me, by the way. Oh, she angry. Where is she? Use your mobility in the air to get clear of explosions on the ground. AP at thirty percent. I barely hurt this thing. This is not going my way at all. I actually have no idea where it's at right now. Oh, there it is. I really think I can kill this thing? Oh, that was bad. All right. Well, that's not good. Huh. Oh, okay. All right. Sure. Okay. Let's see if we can uh, do a little bit better than that. Uh, I felt like my my shots were doing next to nothing to them, but maybe I was missing a bunch. That's it. Try accessing the wreck. I also did get kind of murdered immediately. I don't know that I, I don't know that I like a, a checkpoint here. Feels kind of cheap. Registration number RB23. Rank fits the bill. Call sign. What? Looks like they were on to you after all. I'm in no mood to pick a fight with the PCA. But it doesn't matter. Take it out now. They won't have enough to ID you. That actually kind of hurt it a little. AP at fifty percent. They kind of outplay me there a little bit. Use your mobility in the air to get clear of explosions on the ground. AP at thirty percent. Oh, that went really, really badly. All right, hmm. that's fine. It's fine. Uh, trying to melee is not, not a great strategy. Okay. Okay, this is fine. This is, uh, different. I, I just, I feel like I'm doing zero damage to the enemy. I, I, I don't, I don't know. Alright, That's whatever. It. Try accessing the wreck. Wait, did I not do it? Sorry. Registration number RB23. Rank fits the bill. Call sign. What? Looks like they were on to you after all. I'm in no mood to pick a fight with the PCA. Take it out now, they won't have enough to ID you. Use your mobility in the air to get clear of explosions on the ground. All right. 
right, so far it's uh, maybe going slightly better. was doing better. Uh, and then it kind of all fell apart a little bit. AP at 30%. That went very badly for me. What happened there? My shoulder ammunition at 50%. Maybe it's not a good idea to walk out in front of where he's looking. I, I don't know. Well, I, I mean, I did better. Uh, we do have repair slot things, and we can hide enough. So uh, this time I think I, I got it. I just need a little bit of a... Uh, little bit of stuff. All right, so they're trying to tell me to be less stupid, apparently. Explosive attacks have a blast radius, and even if you dodge the initial hit, it's easy to get caught by the blast if you remain on the ground. See, there they're just like, oh, well, you know, despite him shooting you in the face a multitude of times and having machine guns that just murder you, just fly at him and then do, you know, a melee attack. I mean, I like it. Let's try it. Let's let's give it a shot. That <clears throat> was my my initial plan, and I I seem to be able to get behind him enough. I, look, guys and gals, I I've never played an armor core game. It. It's gonna Try be a learning experience. Back. So please forgive me, uh, my uh, follies here. All right, and it's left arm. Yes. Oh yeah. Registration number RB twenty three. Rank fits the bill. Call sign. Oh. What? Looks like they were on to you after all. I'm in no mood to pick a fight with the PCA. It doesn't matter. Take it out now, they won't have enough to ID you. Uh. Okay. Uh, okay. We recovered. Ah! Use your mobility in the air to get clear of explosions on the ground. Why didn't he shoot or swing with his weapon? Okay. I have a couple seconds. Uh oh. Oh. Okay. AP at fifty percent. AP at thirty percent. This seems like a great plan if it didn't just almost murder me immediately every time. Two repair kits remaining. Okay. AP at fifty percent. Ah! I'm hitting the wrong button that time. AP at thirty percent. Repair kit 
remaining. Okay. much better much closer but whoo they throw a lot of skills at you that you gotta kind of figure out and master at once i was constantly hitting uh l l1 instead of l2 which was not good that that was probably my biggest problem there i mean i could have definitely negated a lot of the damage done to me had i not fallen victim to my own lameness there that's it try accessing the wreck all right can't wait to see uh, Crazy Comrade take this on and just one shot at the very first time. <sighs> It'll be interesting. Registration All right. RB23. Rank fits the bill. Call sign. What? Looks like they were on to you after all. Alright. Okay. Uh. Here's your move. You've got them now. They can kill six to one. Oh, did I do something cool to him? I Oh he he, he messed up now. Oh my, oh my god! I, I was doing great! And then he just one-shot me. I, I mean, I know it wasn't a one-shot, it was a multitude of shots, but like, after the attack, I couldn't get out of... Oh my, that was incredible. Okay, so do, do I have to land underneath him? Like, I figured I could just fall back, get behind cover, and heal. And I couldn't. <laughs> like, I get hit, I get hit again, I get hit again, I get hit again, again, and then I died. I was like, oh, okay, and that was all just me trying to get from like up there to behind this thing and I, I never made it. That's insane. Registration number RB23. Rank fits the bill. Alright. Let's try it again. What? Looks like they were on to you after all. I'm in no mood to pick a fight with the PCA. But it doesn't matter. Take it out now. They won't have enough to ID you. All right, here we go. Alright, we healed. Time the loose end, six, two, one. two repair kits remaining. Ooh, that was nasty. Uh na na na. Nah. Oh, they hit me hard there. Crazy helicopter thing. Oh, I'm just hanging up on him. I'm stuck on him. Oh, great. Uh, yes. Oh, that felt good. Oh, that felt incredible. All right. Holy crap. Oh, that felt so slick. Heavy combat 
Hunter is down. All right, I learned a lot from that fight. Today, Hopefully, I can translate it to other things. Here's the call sign from that license you picked up. Oh, <laughs> we're Raven. I'm aware that uh, the Ravens are the big thing throughout the the entirety of the Armored Core series. So, fitting, fitting. Uh, call sign Raven zero uh, or no rank, and then slash F or independent and expires in three days. Raven. Huh. That's your new name here on Rubicon. Makes sense. Oh boy. Well, I took a bit longer probably than it should have. Uh, cleared mission, illegal entry. Repair cost, yeah. Ammunition cost, yeah. Expenses, sure. Penalties, uh, no penalties. Uh, again, I guess it was kind of a, you know, a, a teach you how to do stuff uh, battle, a tutorial fight, if you will. Coral, a sublime substance. Discovered on Rubicon, a planet on the frontier of developed space. For a time, Coral was a revolutionary energy resource and data conduit, poised to transform human society by leaps and bounds. They called it the Fires of Ibis, a storm of flame that tore through the stars leaving lethal contamination in its wake. Coral, the kindling, was thought to have been utterly consumed, forever lost. However, on Rubicon, the embers continued to burn. Humanity would inevitably return to stoke the fire. Sure. Fires of Rubicon. It makes sense. Huh. Well, hopefully that wasn't too painful. I adapted and grew quite a bit RB while playing, I think. Call sign Raven. Authentication Wait. complete. Removing MIA status. MIA Restoring status. access privileges. Sweet. This is Allmind, the mercenary support system. Hey, Allmind. Welcome back, Raven. Thanks. I'm sure that's goosebumps for a lot of uh, returning armor cord, armored core fans. Looks like you passed the authentication. Raven, that's who you are now. You're on Rubicon. I've picked up some work for you already. Take a look, 621. Just call me Raven, man. My new name, remember? This notification follows restoral of access privileges. Allmind provides a combat training simulator to support its mercenaries. Nice. Your license was in a suspended state. Perhaps you may need a refresher. Maybe. As an added incentive, completion of the exercises will be rewarded with AC parts. Sounds great. You stand to benefit regardless. Yeah, I do. All right, guys and gals. Uh, the following feature is now available. When we get to a, a definitive stopping point, I will break out the first episode. The following feature is now available. AC design. Cool. Uh, emblem required. Or acquired, excuse me. AC data acquired. Tenderfoot G13 Raven. Parts obtained. The head, the HD012 Melander C3. Uh, core for the Melander C3. And the arms for the Melander C3 and the legs, right? Yep, Melander C3. All right. This looks like this is the place, ladies and gentlemen, for us to break off our very first episode of Armored Core 6, Fires of Rubicon, which is great. It's great. I had a lot of fun with that. Uh, that was weird, right? So start starts you off very basic stuff. Fight a few random enemies that are not really fighting back. Just kind of there. You just shoot them. You know, not a big deal. Then it's like, all right, this giant helicopter murder ship is now here. Surprise! Get good or get dead. And I got dead a whole bunch. And then I got better. I don't know if I got good, but I got better. And there was progress being... Now, I will say, it was, it was something, and then I just got obliterated, and then it was something again. So, uh, you know, progress was made. I, I got to see some stuff. I'm glad... That, 
I, I'm insulted, but also glad that they kind of told me, "Hey, dummy, charge at him and hit him, hit him with your sword with your little your little supercharge move." Made things a lot easier. So, I like it. I like it. Uh, first impression so far, everything is great. It looks it looks incredible. It feels really good to play. Um, it's very different from I think just about anything I've ever played except for Damon X Machina, maybe. That's probably the thing this is the most similar to playing. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the episode, folks. Uh, I am going to remind you once again, make sure you head on over midnight tonight or tomorrow, the, the 24th of August, 2023, starting at midnight Eastern. That's very beginning of the day all the way through to the very end of the day. So midnight to midnight, starting on August 25th. Head on over to Crazy Comrade, C R A Z Z Y C O M R A D E. That's Crazy Comrade with two Z's on Twitch. So twitch.tv forward slash Crazy Comrade. He will be doing a 24 hour stream trying to beat the game. Um, he's been excited for this for a long time. Very cool content creator, very underrated, pretty small footprint on YouTube. Um, and a little bit better going on for uh, Twitch as far as uh, you know current viewers and whatnot. So yeah, definitely go support him. It's, like I said, a content creator I like uh, that I watch and that I hope to be able to do stuff with in the future. I, I, like I said, I've reached out to him. We've done like one thing and then we just haven't been able to do anything. I'm, you know, doesn't mean I'm going to just be like, nah, throw him away. So go check him out. Really cool. Very into mecha stuff. Uh, Gundam. All, just all sorts of giant robot things. So if you like giant robot things like Armored Core, go check out his channel on YouTube and on Twitch. And on YouTube, you can actually see the entirety of the Armored Core series from so the very first game to the very last game, and now this game, um, on his YouTube channel. Has he played it all over the last, like, four or five months, six months, something like that? So very, very, very cool stuff. And, yeah, stick around the channel. I plan to play through this as well, hopefully improving as I go. We'll see. Maybe we'll uh, go back to some of the prior uh, games in the series. I don't know. We'll see. Either way, folks, if you want more information about the game, where to get the game, information on the developer, the publisher, any of that stuff, down below in the description of the video, there'll be various links, just like there always are. Uh, just to give you guys ads up in future episodes, less of an intro, less of an outro. This is not a normal intro outro for me. It's a bit more. So uh, you're basically going to go, hi, I'm back, let's go, and we're just going to go into it, and then thanks for stopping by, and I'm out. So apologies that this is like, you guys just babble too much. I know, I know, it's fine. It's fine. Anyway. I'm out. Thank you so much. I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thanks for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer. <laughs>